my channel and uh, this is Mompreneur Diaries. We do a lot of home management videos, organization, cleaning, motivation, motherhood videos and a little bit of home depot. But today we're going to do something different. We're going to do um, flavored toast my eye. Uh, welcome. I want to show you how to flavor your toast my eye so that it's not so plain. So this is what you require. We need salt, lemon, one full lemon, a piece of ginger, eggs, sugar, a grater, uh, some sort of plate or anything that you can use to put your toast my eye after you're done, some bowl to crush our eggs, cooking oil, cinnamon or any other flavor you may need to add if you have vanilla or something, uh, bread, foil just to keep them warm, and kitchen towel of course. So I want to show you a hack that I use because it's supposed to grate the cover of our lemon. So this is what I do. This is a grinder. Then I peel off the covers. Then I put them in the grinder plus the juice, the lemon juice. Then now I'm going to grind this. I'll show you the results. One minute later, this is what you have. See? It's very effective and very efficient. So you can try this next time. Put up the shinda up and feel great. So now I'm going to add this to the grinded ginger. And then to this, I'm going to add cinnamon. So I'm adding cinnamon. Just a little bit of it. And here we do do with you. a pinch of salt just a pinch of salt then eggs uh oh going to corrode and mix it properly. You can add any other flavors you want, uh, but I just prefer cinnamon and lemon. So see, see what we have. Okay. So the next step is very simple. So I'll spread the mixture on the eggs first, I'll spread all of them, then I'll just go and chow and fry. You don't need any magic to do this. It's quite simple. So next time you have visitors, 
tusisikia ati they have a pilau and chick how now we now have this very simple and unique recipe tutacheza tu kawele you see how simple it looks the kind of toast when you make for your chama women you automatically become the chair lady okay. and then it's quite simple in like 10 minutes you're done going to shallow fry so we're going to start you need a pan and now this is where our oil comes in so just add a little oil Then make sure it is spread evenly on the pan. Then make sure the oil is heated enough so that the, your bread won't absorb oil. Just add. Oh, that is not ready. Shall we fry the smokies? I don't deprive them. So try. 